you get there. The General Store on 24 is located on Route 24 in Lewis. Headlines, headlines, you can't get through your day without. On Power 1017. He was pissed. Jess, what you got got today? glasses, though. That's serious. Yeah, well, so was that loss. (laughs) So was that loss, apparently. Man. All right. Tens of thousands of workers in Los Angeles Unified School District plan to walk off the job today over stalled contracts and their talks. And they will be joined in solidarity by teachers in a three day strike that will shut down the nation's second largest school system. The workers were expected to join picket lines before dawn, demanding better wages and increased staffing. The district has more than 500,000 students from Los Angeles and all are part of 25 other cities and unincorporated county areas. So right now, district workers are planning a strike this morning. Amazon will cut about 9,000 more jobs. CEO Andy Jassy announced this on Monday in a memo to the staff. The latest cuts come after the company announced earlier this year that it was eliminating about 18,000 positions as part of a major cost-cutting bid at the e-commerce giant. Jesse says that fresh round of job cuts will take place in the coming weeks and will mostly impact people working in the following divisions. Amazon Web Services, People Experience and Technology, which is PXT, and also Advertising and Twitch. So Amazon to lay off 9,000 more workers. Lunchables, the popular prepackaged meals aimed at kids and parents. Um, They're a staple at school cafeteria tables, and they've been there for decades. But now, possibly, the brand has a new version that's coming out, and the cafeteria will have to give it out itself. So Kraft Heinz, the company that makes them, has developed two styles of Lunchables that meet federal nutrition guidelines set out for the National School Lunch Program, which provides meals to about 30 million kids across the country. And now Lunchables will now be seen in school cafeterias. Lunchables. Yeah. Wow. You know what? Uh, Bryce Root is really into Lunchables, Mm -hmm. but lately they've changed their label. They have, but it's changed like the food inside too. It's different. Well, I don't know about the food, but, and the reason is because when he sees the new label, he says, what is this, an off-brand Lunchable? He does? Yeah. Well, we... That <laughs> you gotta change. You, you can't do that to the kids. No, it happened to us, too. And they changed, like, the nachos, and it's, like, a nachos grande or something, but they changed all of it. The kids don't want change. Nope. They want the same thing that yeah. they have every time. Yeah. Not anymore. So now we don't even get them. I know. We don't either. We don't even get them anymore. And the only reason we don't get them is the label. <laughs> yeah. Well, some of the nuggets changed, too, with the food. Well, I, he didn't do the nuggets, but he, he did do the nachos. And when, he saw, different now. when he saw that those bubble letters, yeah. he said, this is a fake Lunchable. Yeah, I know. <laughs> You're right. You can't You're right, listen. Right. Listen, you. Mm. They don't listen. They don't listen, Bill. That's the problem. Dumb old adults. <laughs> See, adults are dumb. You cannot. You, you, the way you think. Talk to us. We will tell you. The, the way you think is not the want. way the kids think. You're marketing these to kids. Don't come up with your bright ideas. No one wants your bright ideas. Yeah, like the new and improved and all this stuff. No. Nope. No. Doesn't work. No. The bubble, the big picture on it, and it's all like stretched out no. looking. No. It doesn't work. You know why it doesn't work? Because the kids don't know that logo. They're like, nope, that's not what I eat. No. I don't want it. The sub, forget it. They've completely changed the sub one. We used to get the pizza one, mm-hmm. and then see, like, like we, I have we one would of go those. in it's cycles. It's been sitting in my fridge for about six months. So uh, eat it. Just sitting there. Go ahead and eat it. <laughs> um, <laughs> no, no one will eat it, but no one will throw it away. Well, so. I know, I know. Yeah, but what if? Yeah, but she might I know. want it. Well, maybe one day. Well, it might come in clutch. Yeah. Well, you never know. It might be a backup. I see. <laughs> well, we used to go and like buy like a whole like thing full of them, lunchables yeah. every week. Yeah. Nope, not anymore. Won't That's eat it. Same here. So, same which is here. fine. You know, make we're making sandwiches and yeah. doing snacks and all that, but. I'm just saying, Lunchable screwed up. Yep. They have to. They have to put them in the schools now. They have to work out a deal because they're not selling them. You're right. You know? You're right. They went and scammed the schools yeah, to get them in the schools. Right. 
Kraft Heinz, we're coming for you. Yeah, Kraft is the best. I know. Heinz is, is great. Nope. Nope. But they messed this up. They did. Your kids have any problems with uh, Lunchables no, lately, guys? Everything's working out great. All right, let's change it. Yeah. Yeah, that, yeah, that's right. Oh, they're selling out and the kids love it? Oh, you know what? Let's do a new and improved version. Yeah, let's do no, it. No. It's, it doesn't need to be improved. It's let's, already let's good. Let's give it an update. Yeah. No. What's your name? Dell? <laughs> Microsoft? We don't want your stupid update. Keep it. If it works. If, hey, guys, it's working. Let's fix it. Yeah, exactly. See, that's the problem. Hey, guys, everything's going great. Well, let's switch it up. Exactly. You changed the Lunchables. <laughs> now you starved my kid. Great. Great. Now I have to make a sandwich. Exactly. And cut the crust. Yeah, every day. Every day. We have a crust cutter. Oh. <laughs> I go around with the knife. Oh, that's what I used to do. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's what's going on with the Lunchables. It's real. Hey, record sales. Let's switch it. It's real out there with the Lunchables. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yep. Dummies. Yep. Uh, anything else, Jess? Um, in Salisbury, there is a couple things that happened. The Wicomico County Sheriff's Office is investigating a weekend shooting that happened in Salisbury at around 940 p.m. on Saturday. This investigation is continuing. They are asking anyone with any information to please call 410-548-4898. But the victim has now been identified as a 42-year-old man who was allegedly shot in the leg and mm. taken to Title Health for treatment. And again, this investigation does continue. If anyone has any information, call 410-548-4898. And a tragic situation, the Maryland State Police are investigating a fatal crash that happened on Saturday afternoon in Worcester County shortly after 3.30 p.m. Troopers responded to Route 113 northbound at Georgetown Road for a reported crash. The driver of a Tacoma has now been identified as 69-year-old Linda Brown was pronounced dead at the scene. So sad. The driver of the tractor trailer has now been identified as 72-year-old Marius Bow of North Carolina. And that investigation continues into that crash as well. Okay. Yeah, that was all blocked off. Mm -hmm. We uh, were going to Berlin from the Ocean Pines area. So sad. You know, mm -hmm. Saturday and like the whole side of the highway all blocked off. It's a shame. Hours later too. Hours. 641. It's a Bill and Jessica show. We got sports on the way. Okay, go on three. Good morning. One, two, three.